And luckily, this time around, when we got that refreshing air mass, it's coming down for more like areas like Quebec, where the wildfires are a little bit under control compared to Western Canada. As soon as we get the jet stream shifting there from the west, that smoke could be back, but at least not in the near future. A little bit of haze out there, still some residual smoke, but nothing at the ground and nothing that's causing air quality problems. And you see that blue in the sky, and you're going to see that again here for tomorrow. It's a delightful Friday evening. I have to remind Mind you, we're a little past mid August, and to have weather like this is truly hitting it out of the ballpark. A delightful evening of weather this evening, tonight, comfortable sleeping, no AC needed at all. Tomorrow, you may be able to leave the windows open for much of the day. Nice breeze coming in, sunshine, low humidity. Now, even with Sunday's temperature near 90 degrees, it's not all that humid, so it's a very manageable heat. Near record heat on Monday, but this is a different style of heat than what we saw back in July. This doesn't come packaged with a ton of humidity. So the 96 that you see here that I'm forecasting may feel more like 94, 95 in the afternoon, where it feels a little bit cooler. That's because of the low humidity, but that means our temperature will be higher. The record is 97, so we'll keep an eye on Monday. But that's really our only big weather in this pattern. A few thunderstorms possible on Thursday and then maybe next weekend here. But we have a really winning stretch of weather for when it matters most. A lot of people off this time of year. 83 right now in Baltimore City, 84 Westminster. Look at the western part of the state. It'll be interesting to watch the numbers drop down there. All those storms from last night are gone. This is what you want on the weather map here if you want refreshing, cool, comfortable air. Area of upper level low pressure bringing chilly showers to upstate New York, but we're far enough from its influence that we're just getting that dry westerly wind, and so that means some delightful weather. Upper 50s to low 60s here tonight. State of, State of Maryland tomorrow, 85 on Saturday, 90 on Sunday. As we said, manageable heat. Here's Hillary, a textbook-looking buzzsaw hurricane off the coast of Mexico here, moving up to the north. It's the track that really is uh, somewhat unprecedented. We haven't seen California under a tropical storm watch, Southern California. As you can see, though, it will be weakening. Honestly, I think rain is the biggest potential out of this storm system uh, in terms of storm surge. Little to none because the wind direction isn't favorable. And they get Santa Ana winds, so they can handle 50, 60 mile per hour winds. So rain is going to be the big problem from Hillary in California. Meanwhile, our weather is nice and quiet here over the weekend. He builds on Monday, but it's just temporary. Tuesday through Thursday look pretty nice. Guys, over to you.